Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scottalicious McFabulous here and I'm so glad that you guys could join me today. And today I have the full review for the Coach Beat Cross Body Clutch. In this review we will be taking a look at the aging effect of the gloved hand leather as well as what is inside and what can fit inside my handbag. Spoiler alert, this thing can actually fit quite a bit for its size. Deceiving. I want to see the receipts. Now before we hop into today's full handbag review, if you guys love handbags, hauls, coach michael kors the whole lot of those make sure you hit the subscribe button if you are new and if you guys enjoy today's content make sure to hit the like button as it does help me know you enjoy today's video and it helps with that pesky youtube algorithm what's up bitch <laughs> So right off the bat, the first thing I want to say is just how beautiful and how beautifully made this handbag is. I love what Coach has done with the brand. It's no lie. I say that every time I talk about Coach on my channel. So I will be fully honest and say that I was very nervous to grab a gloved hand leather from Coach. Only due to the fact that their leather is just so soft and beautiful. Like... Coach leather is some of the nicest leather on the market, competing with like Gucci and YSL. Like they are like competing for that top price point leather quality wise. And this bag is no different from that. But Coach leather can sometimes be very easily scratched. And so I was very nervous with getting this. I have scratched it a couple times, but it hasn't been as bad as I thought. It has held up beautifully. Absolutely stunning. I now have a new love for gloved hand leather, surprisingly. Like, I really like keeping my leathers as clean and pristine as possible. When we take a look at the creasing of the seams around the flap of the gloved hand leather, it just looks so beautiful. Normally, I would hate creasing like that, but I'm finding it just adds such a beautiful, luxurious effect to it. As well, as we take some looks through the front flap of the gloved hand, you'll notice that there's like almost a certain type of crackling effect of the gloved hand leather. And I really enjoy, I think it looks really nice. It's giving it a really, like it's crinkling in such a beautiful, beautiful manner. Similar to how I talked about the studded Soho in the navy blue color, how with time the leather is aged really nicely. Like, yeah, it doesn't look as brand new and all that, but it just looks so nice. Like, the more it ages, the better it looks. And I'm really excited to see, let's say, in a year's time, how aged the leather will look. Uh, will it age too far? Is it going to age just right? I'm going to be very curious to see how that works, but currently, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. No, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed. When, I, when I'm using this bag, I just feel myself like caressing like the inside crease here or like the bottom of the bag. Just feeling how soft and luxurious the suede feels. It's just... The leather on this bag is immaculate. And I could not be happier with this. Especially considering I got it for 50% off. And it might be at outlet right now. Don't take my word for it. But I do have a feeling if it's not an outlet right now, it will be soon. And then like, you know, the bag just opens like this. So like there's the clasp. 
it's just like a button clasp almost but like fancier sometimes the button clasp i find can be a little tough to navigate but nonetheless it is pretty much a simple button snap closure it it works really nicely, I think, I think, but that's just my opinion. So the hardware on this bag is pretty much just as good as any other coach hardware. I have no complaints with it. I find that it doesn't, the C here hasn't actually like scratched up much, if at all. So that's nice to see. You will have noticed if you do buy the bag, this tag is on the original metal hoop here. The, the coach tag is on the metal hoop here. I attached it to the top handle chain or the uh, decorative chain, however you want to use it. I attached it to the chain itself only because I found when having the crossbody strap on with all three, it was a mess. It was really hard to navigate with like the three the coach tag the coach chain the coach co the, sorry i keep saying coach the cross body strap like the, it all together it was just too much but i find moving it on to the hoop here solved all of that and i find it actually looks a lot cuter just like that it shows the coach tag off a bit better and i i, I like I like it. I like it. And as always, for the final bit of my review of my handbags, I love to do a what is inside my bag. Now quickly, as you do see here, the bag can fit a iPhone 12 or iPhone 12 Pro Max. What? I don't even know. Okay, whatever. Y'all will know. <laughs> the The cute little fancy iPhone. Yes, it holds that perfectly in the front pouch. Now with my phone, I do have a slightly thicker iPhone. I use the iPhone XR with a phone case on it and I find that it doesn't fit as nicely. Though it just, it sticks out just a little bit from the top, but because of the way the flap is, it, there is no hindrance on the bag itself and it doesn't damage anything. It's perfectly fine. As well, inside I, I could fit easily a small pack of Kleenex, which is a nice size comparison, as well as three card slots. Air pods in there, you can put your hand sanitizer, you can throw a chapstick, a lighter, I have my $5 bill in the back pocket there. So you can actually fit quite a bit within this bag. So instead of fitting a wallet in here, I do like to use the card slots. I find when using a wallet with this, it doesn't, you can't fit the most. So do keep in mind it has three card slots and I fully recommend utilizing those. There's some small bags out there that do not fit much, if at all. So it is nice to see a very roomy, surprisingly roomy, small top handle crossbody clutch bag and i do find because the front clasp does have a natural uh lump to it like it sticks out naturally the more you fill it it's not gonna look as warped or it's not gonna look as full as it actually is because of the way this front clasp is made. With all of that being said, if you guys have any questions about this sickening handbag review, please let me know in the comments. I will answer happily, happily. And with all of that being said, I love you all. I will show you a sickening outfit of the day. In a room. Maybe there is right now. And 99 don't believe in you, but all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, hundred people, hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, 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 or a thousand, nine thousand, or nine nine hundred ninety-nine. There can be a hundred people in the room.
Alrighty, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's outfit of the day, and I hope you guys enjoyed the full review to the Coach Beat Cross Body Clutch. Because, girl, this bag is sickening, and it might be a little bag, but for a little bag, it holds quite the punch. Like, I will not lie to y'all. And at first, this kind of was an impulse purchase, like a depression purchase, but I'm actually really glad I did because this thing, the color, stunning. The style, stunning. How much do you hold for its size? Stunning. Girl, there is just, I love this bag, and it's versatile as all clutch, crossbody, shoulder bag, literally like the whole nine yards. Top handle, you can do anything with this and what's even more awesome is the fact that the chain can be put on other bags. But I'll stop ranting and raving and I will leave you guys alone. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please hit the like button. Subscribe if you are new. Comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's video or outfit. Share with your friends and family. As well, check out that description box below for a Instagram link, a, a Discord notification squad link, as well as a Facebook page link. I love you all so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs> I think it was good. I don't, I don't. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's over.